five surefire ways to drastically improve your vocabulary. What if I use the idioms, I'm fit as a fiddle instead of saying I'm healthy, or raining on one's parade instead of saying ruining one's plans? What if you received a compliment that your work was phenomenal? Doesn't it sound better than rather just saying your work was good? Obviously, the word phenomenal has more impact, isn't it? Won't it be fantastic if you use the right words or phrases in the right time to make a mark in any conversation and to sound super powerful and impactful? Words are building blocks in any communication. It can make a communication either strong or weak. It can actually make it more powerful or extremely damaging. Let me give you five surefire ways in which you can drastically improve your vocabulary. Keep a thesaurus close by and make dictionary your best friend. Look up the words you come across on a day-to-day basis and maintain your own personal vocabulary bank like a pocketbook. Whether it is a physical paperback or an online dictionary or app, dictionary has always been an indispensable resource for improving your vocabulary. Using word associations and visualization techniques. Visualize the vocabulary by attaching a certain image to it. You can also link the vocabulary with word associations and mnemonics in order to easily recall and recollect it later. Apply new words. As it said, use it or lose it. Use the words you learn whenever you get a chance. You can also create a concept map or a mind map to link one word with many different words in order to expand your word bank. using word anatomy to create your own personal lexicon. Rather than memorizing the words, try understanding the words deeply by using its origins, which is called etymology, prefixes, suffixes, and word roots. For example, in the word multilingual, multi or multi means many, lingua means language, and al, which is a suffix, makes it an adjective. I would like to conclude saying that Vocabulary serves as a very useful and fundamental tool for communication and acquiring knowledge. However, developing an extensive vocabulary is the biggest challenge for non-native English speakers like us who are learning English as a second language. A good vocabulary will not only help you boost your self-confidence, but will also make you an excellent communicator.